We're going nowhere in a hurry. I think we missed the tide a little bit. Oh, are we wait. So sketchy steaming home last night, eh? Yeah, I know. It's fucking. <laughs> <laughs> you can't have this deep at all. Yeah. Yeah, you got to that part where it's like whirlpooly. Oh, yeah, you That's just get thrown really around, hard. eh? <laughs> Camping on trips like this, and you got no milk and stuff, you get these coffee and milk in a can. The best coffee. You don't need milk. All you do is add hot water. You want tongs? Thanks, you'll be right. Here, boy. Yeah, do you need one, Joe? Oh, shit. That's like going. That's one way to fuck up your morning. That's like going bathing, going and catch mullet for like two hours and then somebody dropping the lid, taking the lid, the lid falling off and going, oh. Not only do you lose the water, the fire's going down. <laughs> That's just like as soon as we get coffee, we'll be yeah. a jump in the back of our boat. Yeah. <laughs> I watched it and it started tilting forwards, and I was like, I should grab another stick, and then it just went down. Like yeah, the boat's floating. Timed it perfect. Guy on the cooker. Good day. I fucking <laughs> cooking camping. Yeah. So and two. Yes! <laughs> Not over yet. You ever, ever had that coffee drip on? Look at that, by the time we boil a coffee, Boat's ready to go. Another glassy morning. We're gonna head back down the bottom of the bay, try for some barramundi again. Oh, it's too bloody good. The boat's starting to get a bit pongy after five days fishing. There's barra scales and finger mark scales all through the bottom of it. <laughs> Means success. Sun shower. Bloody beautiful. It's pulled it down a heap. Wolves went to a first fish of the day.
You on the net? Yeah. Not bad, just dropped on the snag within oh, two minutes. That's a. Ew. Keeping him. Get it naked. What you fishing for, Joshy? Fucking hand line. <laughs> yeah, that's something. Hope you got a good nut at the end of your spool. Yeah. <laughs> Fully spooled. So, do you reckon your line's all the way back over there? Having a bit of a seafood fiesta tonight. We got fresh triple tail. Got a heap of prawns. Got a mud crab. We got a bucket of oysters. That's living, Barry. That's bloody living.
Have a look at Joshy's spread. A few prawns from the cast net. Mud crab. Not too sweet, eh? Bucket of oysters. Kilpatrick. Oysters? Yeah. And a whole triple tail. That's a proper Kimberley feed. Right there. Nice. Oh, have a look at that! It's heavy. Bacon, a bit of Worcestershire sauce. How do you say it? Worcestershire. Worcestershire. Some people say Worcester. Worcester. <laughs> one season sort of done. Bacon wrap. These boys cooking on a gas cooker. <laughs> hey, rookies. Say camping. Who's camping? You've been watching <laughs> too much fire to fork, mate. <laughs> Who's yours called a camp stove? <laughs> <laughs> Prawns, triple tail, some chippies, some corn. We're gonna top that off. Bit of pork. Let me pork go. I get Billy on the boil, eh? While we're That's a 
trip done and dusted. Traveled 259 miles and we've still got another 70 k's head back to where we launched. Well, I think uh, one of the Josh is sleeping. He's out cold. This whole trip we've sort of just been running um, ice, a lot of ice. And uh, we've got solar as well, a uh, third deep cycle battery. And uh, that allows us to, you know, fill out our fish and put it in, uh, wrap them up, put them in the angle. There's a lot of fish up here that you can't bring back. Probably keep a fair piece in whole way to be honest. Yeah. A couple of them be a finger mark and um fill it fill it for me in consumption set. That's it, job done. Back on the trailer. Now drive back to Broomtown.